So this is the property on C Street in Coronado that's making the multi-million dollar donation possible. Decades ago, the Dong family rented, then purchased this property from a black family when nobody else would. To help honor that kindness, the Dong family now planning to use $5 million of the proceeds from the sale to help black students at SDSU. That's Lloyd Dong Jr. and brother Ron pictured in front of their family home on Coronado. The family now using the cash cow to help fund a full circle moment to honor the men who helped their immigrant family nearly a century ago. Like it feels major really impact. good, better than we ever anticipated. This story starts in 1939, a time when the Dong's parents couldn't find a home to rent in Coronado because of racially restrictive housing laws. That is until Gus Thompson and his wife Emma opened their doors to their home. Thompson, a former slave turned Coronado entrepreneur, allowed the Chinese American family to rent and eventually buy their Coronado property, helping them achieve their American dream. And his allowing my father to live and work in a place where he would not otherwise have been able to. So this was a payback. That payback coming in the form of a $5 million donation to San Diego State University's Black Resource Center and renaming it after Emma and Gus Thompson. And it's about passing it forward. So this goes right along with the kinds of things that we're teaching them already. Dr. Brandon Gamble heads the Black Resource Center. He says not only will the funding help provide scholarships, but it will also go towards supporting students by making sure upper class mentors are readily available for lower classmen as well as being able to bring in professional resources. So we've had folks from LinkedIn um, and other larger corporations come and talk to our students and also do career fairs that directly impact our students' pathway towards success. That's the kind of leg up Lloyd Dong is hoping to affect through his family's donation. And then you have to perform, but without a background in education, you don't even get your foot in the door. Forever grateful for the doors opened to his family nearly a century ago by Gus and Emma Thompson, Lloyd, his wife, and their family now planning to leave a lasting legacy that'll help the Thompson name live on. But through the money, many, many useful beings are going to profit the society. So that's kind of the joy. Omari Fleming, NBC7. A lot of good people helping others. Uh, the Black Resource Center is hoping to have its grand renaming after the Thompsons sometime this fall. Mm -hmm.